What's up everybody, Courtney Morse, Natural Wellness Physiotherapy, talking about progressing your neck stabilization exercises, okay? So we've done the ones where we're lying down and we're doing our ranges of motion through here. Um, we've done our chin tucks and our different directions. Uh, now we wanna progress those a little bit. We're gonna talk about the three types of muscle contractions that we have. Number one, if we have a dumbbell in our hand, right? Um, we start with the dumbbell, we shorten it this way, that's a concentric contraction. contraction. If we are holding that dumbbell and we're lowering it down slowly against gravity, that's an eccentric contraction. Or if we have it in one place and we're just, you know, contracting that muscle without moving it, that's an isometric contraction. And that's the one we're going to work on today, okay? So when we do this, again, we want to maintain a good, a good position, our ears above our shoulders. And what we're going to do is we're going to initially use our hand for some uh, resistance here, okay? So we're going to place our hand right here on our forehead and again, maintaining proper posture through here. And we're going to push with our hand um, backward, okay? Our neck is just going to respond to the resistance that you provide, okay? So this is not a big, strong, strengthening exercise. This is an endurance exercise. So you are looking for longer uh, duration uh, holds, 30 seconds, 45 seconds, 60 seconds at a time here um, to try to increase the stability of these neck muscles. When they are stronger, that's gonna allow these trap muscles back here to relax a little bit, okay? So you'll place this hand up here and you're gonna push backward this way and your neck is just gonna kick in and fire, okay? And you're gonna hold this again for 30 seconds or so and maybe do two or three. Now, we have the kind of, we kind of have the tendency to maybe shift a little bit to one side or the, to whichever side is up this, the, that way. So you might do a little bit on both sides, okay? The other ones that we're gonna do, we're gonna do side bending, okay? So again, Maintaining this neutral, you know, nose in line with the sternum. We're applying pressure here and we're providing resistance. We'll feel that same side kick on right through here, the sternomastoid and some of these other ones. Make sure that we're doing both sides. We'll see that kick on and you can see it right there kicking on. Um, we'll also do a little bit of rotation, okay? So we're gonna put kind of the palm of our hand against our cheekbone here uh, and then we're gonna turn into that side, right? Well, let me, let me rephrase that. We're gonna push this way and we're gonna resist. Again, you'll see this one turn on. You kind of get the smushed, Sharpe looking face on there. And that's how you know you're doing it right. Okay, same thing through there. Now, again, after you get a little bit more advanced with these, you might start doing some diagonal patterns. You know, again, we don't exist strictly in these nice frontal planes here. Stuff goes on in all different directions. So work on those in each direction. And then over the course of time, we'll start adding some different types of contractions um, that will help us, again, stabilize in other positions. So if you have any questions, don't hesitate to call or email me um, and we will help you work through these exercises. Until next time, Courtney Morse, Natural Wellness Physiotherapy.